let's see the heating effect of current okay so what do you mean by heating effect of current it means now if there is a wire okay uh, when current will flow through this wire okay, then this wire will be heated okay or it will be increased the reason is that when current is flowing that means now the charge or electrons are flowing inside this conductor or wire now there is some frictions or work done okay so due to the friction and work done this wire will be heat up okay or there will be creation of heat so this effect of current is known as heating effect of current clear now what is the condition number one this heat edge will be directly proportional to the square of current or when you increase the current so heat also will be increases if there is no current or current is zero heat also may be zero okay and number two number two is if the resistance of this wire is very high okay then the current also will feel very much difficult to flow so there is will be more friction so now when there is increase in resistance so heat also will be increases third conditions if you flow the current through this wire so it takes time if you increase the time okay so heat also increases so this these are the conditions current resistance and time through this wire so in this condition heat will be increases now when you combine all these three conditions within with a single equation so this heat will be equals to square of current okay, its resistance and time so this heat is what heat is energy so this heat will be joule in si okay now there is another unit which is called calorie okay now when you convert this joule into calorie you will get 0 0.2 okay i square r t c a cal this means calorie okay. because you know that one calorie energy is equal to 4.2 joule or one joule will be one joule will be equal approximately not actual value this is very close to value 0 0.24 calorie okay so this is very important relations on your heating effect of current if you know the current resistance and time you can find how much energy or how much calorie is flowing through this wire so which produces heat that's why the example is our electric bulb electric bulb becomes hot after flowing current through it our electrical heater okay when current flows through it the heater will be switched off or it gives the heat energy you can find out if you know the currents uh, this resistance and time okay